What's up guys, Shane Starnes here and I just upgraded my living room entertainment space thanks to Sony. Sony sent out their brand new X90L full array LED TV plus a surround sound system, plus a personal surround sound system. So in this video, we're gonna cover all of that. Once again, thanks to Sony for sending all of this awesome stuff out. Let's go ahead and get started. This video is sponsored by Chubby Cable. I know I'm not the only one that's ever had to deal with this first world struggle. You wanna scroll through TikTok and unwind from the day, but your phone needs to be charged. The only problem is the three foot cord that came with your phone. It's just not long enough to reach the outlet on the other side of the room. You've got a few options here. You can totally move your king size bed or you can pick up a Chubby 3.0. The Chubby 3.0 is the world's longest fast charging cable with lengths of up to 20 feet. You're gonna be able to charge your phone or device no matter where you are in the room, no matter where the outlet is. The Chubby 3.0 has support for up to 100 watts of power. Chubby cables support a range of models, including type C, C to C, and iPhone PD, USB C to C Lightning. And they're built to last with high quality materials and construction, making these durable enough to withstand daily wear and tear, ensuring these will last for years to come. Chubbycable.com also has an endless list of other accessories, including power banks with a 10,000 milliamp hour capacity capacity and their 65 watt GAN 2 port wall chargers are a great choice for those looking for high speed charging solutions. I'll be sure to include links in the description of where you can pick up your Chubby 3.0 today. The centerpiece and most exciting part of this setup is the Sony Bravia XR 75 inch X90L full array LED TV. That is a mouthful of uh, the main benefit here. So I had an LED TV before and Traditional LED TVs have one bar of LED lights that are supposed to backlight the entire screen. When you're dealing with a much larger screen, that means that you're not getting deep, rich blacks and bright, colorful colors. Sony has really stepped up the game here with the full array LED TV. So basically what you get is many LED lights that provide local lighting and dimming across the entire screen. This means you'll get deeper, richer blacks, and it even means you're gonna get an overall brighter screen. If you have a room like I have, my living room space has lots of open windows and lots of bright sunlight throughout the day, this is probably the best option for you. The X90L gets brighter than most OLEDs on the market, unless of course you're looking at Sony's new A95L, which can reach about the same brightness as the X90L. Whether I was watching this TV in the middle of the day with a bright sunny room or in the evening, I was able to clearly see the picture thanks to that extra bright display. Thanks to the Cognitive Processor XR, this TV delivers a wide dynamic contrast and natural colors replicating how we see colors in the real world. This TV also delivers deep inky blacks thanks to the full array LED backlight system. The X90L includes Google TV. I was actually able to ditch my Android TV box as I had everything that I needed, access to all of my favorite apps like Netflix, Disney Plus, and even Hulu and Apple TV right there from the television. I didn't need any other devices to connect to the content I watched the most. The TV in my living room is mostly used for game time. So whenever the football game's on or the NBA is on, that's where we all congregate to watch the game. The X90L features 120 frames per second or 120 hertz refresh rate. That means all the action is very smooth and you don't have to worry about blurry images or pixelated images like you would on TVs with less refresh rate. Needless to say, the Sony Bravia XR X90L is definitely a major upgrade in my living room entertainment setup. If you're gonna have a truly upgraded setup, then you're gonna need a really great surround sound system. Sony also sent out the A5000 premium sound bar that includes 360 spatial audio and spatial mapping, so it gives you a 3D surround sound effect. But they didn't stop there. They actually also sent out a wireless subwoofer and two wireless rear speakers, so I get the full cinematic theater experience right there in my living room. One of the things that I really loved about this was just how easy it was to set up. All I had to do was plug in the main sound bar into my television, and then from there, the wireless subwoofer and wireless rear speakers just had to be plugged into a wall outlet, and they automatically connected 
to the soundbar without me having to jump into an application, without me having to go into a menu on the TV. They just connected automatically. I love the fact that I didn't have to run any sound wires to the subwoofer and no sound wires to the rear speakers. All I needed was a power outlet. Setup on this was incredibly easy and I feel like anybody could set this system up. The other thing that I really love about this system is it will optimize the sound for the room. So it's actually going to test the sound and acoustics in your room, and then it's going to adjust the sound accordingly, giving you the ultimate 360 degree 3D surround sound experience. Whether I'm listening to the latest tunes on YouTube music, or watching the latest blockbuster on Netflix, the sound coming out of the system is truly immersive and the bass rattles and makes me feel like I'm a part of the scene. This is definitely better than just using the speakers on the TV itself and especially for this oversized living room that I have. It is school time, which means that the kiddos are getting to bed by 8.30 or nine o'clock but I may still wanna watch a movie or watch a game or something like that. Luckily for me, Sony also sent out their NS7 wireless wearable TV speaker so I can still get the 3D surround sound experience without waking up my kids. I could also see this as being super useful if you wanna get that surround sound experience and you have neighbors that are really close by. Maybe you live in an apartment complex and you don't really wanna be rattling the walls because you may annoy your neighbors, this is definitely great for those situations. This speaker is optimized for your personal listening experience. You even take a picture of the shape of your ears and it can tune the sound accordingly to give you a truly immersive experience without waking up the neighbors. The other thing that I really liked about this speaker is if I'm listening to music on the TV or if I'm watching uh, sports or something like that, I can walk around the house with this speaker around my neck and continue to listen to what's playing on the TV. This is super helpful when I'm going from the living room to the kitchen, or if I just have a house full of people and I wanna be able to focus on the TV, I have my own personal listening experience around my neck. Overall, if you're looking to upgrade your entertainment setup, then I can definitely recommend the X90L. The full array LED TV has its advantages. First of all, it's definitely less expensive than an OLED TV. And in most cases, it even gets brighter. So certainly if you have a bright environment that's well lit up during the day like I do, this would definitely be a great option. If you're looking to upgrade your sound, the A5000 soundbar may be enough for smaller spaces as it does deliver that 360 spatial audio experience. If you have a larger area like me, then you may wanna consider adding the rear speakers and the subwoofer for an overall more immersive experience. I'll be sure to include links in the description of where you can get all of these for yourself. That about wraps it up for this video. Thanks guys for watching, be blessed. I'll see you in the next one.